When it comes to his day job, Sergeant First Class Colton Smith has a pretty typical setup. So day to day, most of the time I'm in an office. I'm in an office setting just like this, uh, working the calendars for the SEAC as well as travel plans with people all over the world. He works in the office of Command Sergeant Major John Troxell, where he helps plan and handle his boss's trips and travel. I am his action officer and operations NCO, so what I do, action officer is the fancy title, Basically anything that comes down that's actionable, we need to work on any trips. I'll prepare the trip, I'll execute the trip, and then I'll close that trip out. But twice a day, Smith descends into the catacombs of the Pentagon, where he does something a little more exuberant. <laughs> Along with being an active duty soldier, Smith is also a professional MMA fighter, a passion and talent he discovered while deployed to Baghdad in 2007. During the surge, Outside of working out again during our free time, there wasn't a whole lot to do but just dwell on what happened that day or uh, you know, the atrocities we've seen in war. Uh, so I went to the, uh, the local market and I got some, uh, some UFC DVDs, DVD 1 through like UFC 40 or something. And I watched those on my little portable DVD player in my free time and uh, that kind of sparked my interest. I was like, you know what, I want to do this, I can do this. Uh, I got a punching bag from there, bought a punching bag from the local market downtown in Baghdad, uh, in Ghazalia. And I put it up in our, in our stairwell, actually, in the house that we took over in the middle of Baghdad, in Gaza, western Baghdad, in Ghazalia. And, uh, you know, started hitting the punching bag. And I told all my guys, I'm like, listen, I'm going to be in UFC 150. You watch, you know, and they're all laughing. Yeah, right. Well, turns out I was actually in UFC 160, so uh, it wasn't too far off from, from the prophecy that I had. Smith began pursuing his goal when he returned to the U.S. in 2008 and immediately saw success. In 2012, Smith participated in and won season 16 of The Ultimate Fighter. So I'm the only soldier ever to fight on, while on active duty in the UFC. Um, uh, so I was in the UFC for over two years. I was in the Ultimate Fighter television series as well. And I'm the only one to ever do it while on active duty. Now Smith is training for his first fight in two years. He'll be facing off against Sean Brady in the Shogun fight for the welterweight title belt at the Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Hollywood, Florida on March 17th. 11-0. Guys never tasted defeat. Uh, full-time fighter, obviously. We talked about it previously. I'm a full-time soldier. Uh, Colton's probably the most dedicated athlete that I've ever been involved with or been around. This fight is a three-round fight. He's been training for a five-round fight. And, that, and that's what's going to get his hand raised. Smith goes into every fight and training workout remembering his brothers and sisters in arms. I put a lot more pressure on my shoulders because I am representing so many men and women in uniform. And it pushes me harder to know, you know, I have all these service members, my subordinates, my peers, my leaders that are going to be watching me when I fight. And, in, you know, a lot of it, I feel the pressure that I need to go out there. I need to execute like they would a mini mission and accomplish that mission and defeat my opponent. And not only defeat my opponent, but put an exclamation point on it for them. From outside the cage, in the Pentagon Athletic Center, I'm Nicole Bauke.